My name's Miles and I ride the DGR for my father who died from prostate cancer way too early. So my father was diagnosed with prostate cancer really too late in the condition to be able to, to cure it or to stop it. For me, riding the DGR is, a, is two things really. One, it's such a fantastic event you know, with like-minded people. I've been very lucky on the three or four times I've ridden it to ride in the sunshine around central London. Um, so it's quite spectacular. Uh, it's really easy going, it's really friendly. Um, I go with my wife and we ride with some of our mates as well. So it's a fabulous day out. Um, but the second reason is, is you know, it means more to me than just a day out both because it's in support of uh, um, a cause and, and a cancer that, um, that I feel very passionate about, um, but also I work for Triumph. I think Triumph's support of this and seeing it grow year on year from a small event to just a global phenomenon um, has been really rewarding for everyone involved that I work with. Um, it's not really a marketing exercise or about advertising, you know, this is something that uh, really people have quite a strong connection with not only because obviously it's a great day out riding and you know it gets um, gets people together on their bikes um, but of course because of the charity um, and the awareness of mental health and prostate cancer uh, it's a really powerful thing it's extremely easy to be part of the DGR you just go to the website register and fundraise um, and it's in obviously I mean I hope it would go without saying it's incredibly important the fundraising um, because that's what it's for. It's for, uh, it's for supporting the, the causes and uh, mental health and the prostate cancer that the DGR, uh, the DGR stands for. So have a great day, but also you've got to fundraise. You've really got to put, uh, put something yourself into it.